have to make sure I don't do any spying around here. <laughs> oh, no, you better not. Especially for those Russians. Oh, yeah, they're the, they're the worst, right? This is Matthew Reese, an Emmy Award-winning Welsh actor known for playing a Russian spy masquerading as American travel agent Philip Jennings in The Americans. And he plays Lloyd Vogel, a journalist tasked with interviewing beloved icon Fred Rogers in A Beautiful Day in the Neighborhood. Perhaps unbeknownst to most Americans, Matthew is pretty much a double agent in real life. Wales is steeped in a very long line of storytelling. He's yet another one of those UK actors hiding his accent to play pretty much anybody. But he did start off in the UK with his first film role in the Welsh film Be Brave, speaking entirely in Welsh. Matthew spent the following decade showing off his versatility, convincing audiences that he actually was a Welshman drifting through life in House of America, a mild-mannered college kid in Peaches, or Shakespearean antagonist Demetrius in Titus. And shall she carry this unto her grave? Eventually, he did successfully infiltrate America, like when he guest starred in the final episode of Columbo trying to cover up a murder by burying the body under a fish tank. Come on, Matthew, it's Columbo, he's gonna figure it out. Got it right here. I got a warrant. I'm sorry? Then in 2006, Matthew landed his first major series regular role in the ABC drama Brothers and Sisters. His character, the openly gay Kevin Walker, one of five siblings navigating life and relationships, was actually a big step forward in LGBTQ representation on television during a time when Will and Grace was really one of the only series doing that. Scotty, please take this ring as a symbol of my love and devotion. Two years after Brothers and Sisters ended, Matthew starred in the critically acclaimed series The Americans as Philip Jennings, a travel agent living the American dream with his wife and two kids, who also murders people and has a, a, wow, he's got another wife too, okay. And you make any noise, I will kill you immediately. So he actually played a KGB officer who embedded himself into American society for almost 20 years to spy on the US. You're the one who keeps saying how dangerous things are and how we're at the edge of war. I say our job is to try and stop that from happening. What's fun about Matthew's character, Philip, is that he's kind of an actor as well. Throughout the series, he dons 50 different combinations of wigs, facial hair, and accessories, and combined with various accents and mannerisms, successfully convinces people that he's an airline pilot, or a janitor, or a CIA agent, or even an old Canadian guy. We had a job to do. His various performances as Philip Jennings earned him an Emmy Award in 2018. During and after The Americans, Matthew didn't stop the disguises, playing a military analyst in Spielberg's The Post, a British colonial hunter in Mowgli Legend of the Jungle, You're a fast learner. and he was nominated for an Emmy for his performance as a sleazy author in an episode of Girls. I just want to feel close to someone in a way that I haven't in a long time. And who knows, maybe Matthew got some tips from the everyman expert himself, Tom Hanks, when he played an everyman journalist interviewing Mr. Rogers in A Beautiful Day in the Neighborhood. Whatever form he may take, chameleon Matthew Reese has really flown under the radar, delivering authentic performances in film and television for over two decades. Yeah, okay, but he's not fooling us for a second. We know that's him under all these disguises, and we also know he's awesome. 